Now we're going to establish the stride groove. Now usually when you think about the stride groove, you think about older songs, the old style Dixieland, and the old, even old swing tunes that are played in stride. And that's a great style to learn because there are a lot of tunes that you can play once you enjoy uh, the stride groove. However, there is also use for the stride style in a more modern setting. For instance, uh, I believe that Bill Evans used stride, but he did it in a modified way, in his own way. And a lot of the uh, solo pianists use stride all the time. So let's take a look at it. And let's take a look at it one step at a time. So we're going to start with the bass line. I have a tune here. It's just an old tune called Ain't Misbehavin' by Fats Waller. And we're going to look at the bass line. Now, as you know, the stride style is like a two-beat style, like one, two. Kind of like that. So I use a little lead in. And for instance, I might go either a half step or a whole step as a lead in. And I try to emulate the way a bass player would play. So let's play through the tune using a metronome. One, two, one, two, three, four. I was singing a little bit and Now you if you want you can add tense like I'd add uh, sixths like that. Or throw in the like this, throw in the seventh. And so far we've done this totally with the left hand. In the next lesson, we'll add in the right hand.